Turning Point for Women and Families is the first non-profit um, in New York to address domestic violence issues in the Muslim community to work with Muslim women um, and um, it still is the only one in the five boroughs. Um, we also have a youth development program for teenage Muslim girls and young women where we teach them leadership skills and communication skills and just the value of community service and volunteering and all of that um, and we do a lot of community outreach and education and we train social work interns as well. A lot of things uh, but my own experience in a bad marriage that was one but more importantly it was the backlash of 9-11. Uh, where I had been working with women um, victims of domestic violence for a long time and serving on several boards at that time and then I realized that 9-11 had made it very very difficult it's hard for women to come out and talk about this issue anyway and, and communities tend to be in denial but 9-11 kind of isolated them completely and also the lack of understanding among non-Muslim service providers towards the needs of Muslim women and, and the diversity come from so many countries so all of those things. Well immigrants as you know in, in every country ha have a difficult time adjusting to the new social norms and the laws and language barriers and often uh, financial barriers um, and, and really um, becoming comfortable in that environment um, and it's hard to do when there's fear and there's mistrust and there are all of those things happening and, and community resources are far and few. I have just finished uh, an eight nine day stay in Barcelona where I came as a member of the interfaith delegation from New York and UNESCO um, CAT had organized this um, so I've been very very busy and I've just arrived this morning and spoke at the library a little while ago which was went really well and then I'm just taking a bit of time off to, to see Spain.